the bride has arrived. Everyone's making noise. Let's get the show started. This is Coastlands Musgrave. Show reel. This is Coastlands Musgrave. We're gonna make this a wedding and wedding reception to remember for Amma and Jasmina. Check out the scenes, guys. It's the first time events to remember is covering this. What's up, guys? My name is Kavish. I'm gonna be your MC. Let's show you the scenes. <laughs> Just as they finally arrived, I know you've planned this day for over a year. I still think you planned it since the day you met me. I never wait for my proposal. But I'm glad you said I can't wait to start the next chapter of my life with you. choosing me and for literally being the perfect man any woman would desire. I love you Amar. It's beautiful, right? The port of Durban. All right, so Amar and Jasmina, how did they meet? They met online. You guys know what online means. I don't need to explain, right? And when they met online, she instantly knew she's gonna marry this guy, just like that. He is real. He looked at her and he knew, yeah, she's into me. Anyway, they started dating, went to Woolworths. They had juice at Woolworths. <laughs> then they went to Old Town, Italy. Then they met again and again, and then became a couple. And here we are today. Plain and simple, absolutely love it. Single people watching this, meet online. It works. Let's show you the rest of it. Also a lovely 360 camera set up to my right there. There's a, a young gentleman by the name of Nikhil Singh who will be assisting you guys. Uh, that's going to happen while you guys are also having your lunch. Now, how does lunch work? You can see there's two buffet stations set up on either side, right? So the buffet stations on my left, 
that's the vegetarian section, and the ones on the right hand side are the vegetarian section. <laughs> hey, I'll start Saturday to luck here, man. <laughs> Alright, just a few more seconds and then I'll be making the big announcement. Family, friends, make some noise for our newlyweds! Let's stand, let's go! Welcome to the family. Don't forget your good child now. <laughs> Congrats, Justin Boy. Just welcome to the Kuchal family. Finally, you have the Kuchal surname behind you. Um, we're looking forward to having a part of our family and welcome you with our open hearts and wish you both everything of the best for the future. Love you, Amara and Jess, wishing you all the best for this new adventure ahead. Lots of love. you guys to make some noise now all right so let's start here first all Jasmina's family and friends make some noise <laughs> nice nice all Amber's family and friends make some noise <laughs> it wasn't a competition <laughs> but Kim Jo Yar <laughs> oh wow hey y'all is that Came on one busload and came to this venue, <laughs> representing. <laughs> is this how you allow it to all the family functions? <laughs> can see this, this is a family you married into now. Just can see, can see they don't need a mic. Yeah. Where's the one those when we started this? Where's where's Kavina Kaki? Where are you? Put your put your hand up. I just want to see where. Are you? Hey, you. <laughs> this one. This one here. <laughs> all right, family and friends. Uh, we have a few speakers, of course, going to be saying some words of love to the couple. It goes without saying how proud I am, as Amor's eldest sister, to see him successfully reach the stage in his life, where he is extending himself to Jasmina and embarking on his journey of starting his own family. Life is not always what you picture it or plan in your mind, but it can be what you want it to be every day. I've had the pleasure of knowing Jasmina for the past two years. First and foremost, I want to express my heartfelt congratulations 
to Jasmina and Amar on their special day. Today is a celebration of love, commitment and the beautiful journey that lies ahead of them. My fondest memory of growing up with Jazz is our shared love of the Bollywood movies which we grew up watching together. We used to dance to our favorite songs which we still do today. We used to speak Hindi to each other, a little bit broken Hindi that we used to learn from the movies. And that became our staple language in the house, much to the amusement of our parents. And the highlight that we would have on the weekends is going DVD shopping together. <laughs> this was our true bonding time as sisters. And Jazz was actually quite so obsessed and fanatical about our DVD collection that she would spend a fair amount of time sorting it into alphabetical order and any one of us that would go and upset it or take something out of the collection without putting it back in its correct place would have to deal with her and her tantrums. Well, let's go! All right, let's start here. Where did you go to for I went to my husband, he was too slow. Somebody else came to you. <laughs> you. <laughs> you. <laughs> Who's, whose wallet is this? This is yours, Yash. Yes. No. Oh, Sanjay buys. Sa uh, husband, where are you? Put your, where's the wallet? <laughs> Watch, go. A man's tie, go! Oh my word! <laughs> okay, let, let's let's go here. Firstly, are you okay? Did you get injured? Almost. Almost, almost. My you see the coastlands, all the safety officers came on the one. Okay, whose tie? Uh, it's my husband's. Husband's tie. Well, okay, he did take it off, but... She actually has my father's tie. <laughs> Where's your dad? Well, you should have gone to what, what happened? I missed it. I was looking there. <laughs> dad? What happened? <laughs> Alright, give her a big round of applause. She tried. She tried. She tried. I need to ask... Uh, the tie, do you, how did you get this? The poor uncle, I think he didn't know what to do. <laughs> he gave it to you instead of his own daughter. <laughs> like a man's shoe, go! What happened? I don't know who wears boots to a wedding. That was the wrong pick. <laughs> I'll give a bigger round of applause. I'll run up right there. Uh, whose shoe is this? The uncle. <laughs> Does the uncle know you took the shoeless? It's still tied on this thing, man. Yes, you'll win. Everyone, make some noise. Amar, I truly can't think of anyone who is more deserving to have the moments than you. You've shown yourself to be selfless to a fault, always putting the needs of others ahead of yourself for as long as I've known you. Your hard work, drive, and mindset to reach, your personal and professional goals you have set out for yourself will continue to hold you in good stead whatever you want to achieve in life. As you and Jess start your lives together, I can only wish you everything of the best. Amma, to you, I'm very sorry, Bri. But you realize that you are son-in-law number two. <laughs> two. So by definition, and pure numerical ascendancy, I am the favorite, <laughs> and I am the best son-in-law. So my advice to you is just be a good loser, <laughs> and we can be friends forever. Yeah. To so bride and groom, I wish you all the love and happiness. Yeah. Yeah. And I eagerly look forward to spending a blissful lifetime with you. 
Thank you for walking out of my dreams and turning my life into a little piece of heaven. My dearest bride and now adorable wife, you are everything good in my life. We have got the strongest foundations, built a palace with our love, painted it with the color of joy and furnished it with happiness. Wherever we go, we will take this palace that we built together because together is the most beautiful place to be.